You know what? There's a really big buzz going on throughout Pittsburgh, especially at the Pittsburgh Zoo. And here with the exciting news and the big announcement, our resident veterinarian, early show correspondent, Dr. Debbie Turner Bell. Hello. And what is it all about up there? Big bouncing babies at the Pittsburgh big Zoo. Big being the operative word. Big, big. July was a really big month for the, at the elephant exhibit at the Pittsburgh Zoo. Angelina came into the world weighing a mere 284 pounds. And two weeks later, Zuri appeared at bouncing 247 pounds. Two baby African elephants at one zoo is rare and it's exhausting. Come on. Stretch the legs out. Come on. Seeing African elephants on a morning walk. walk is impressive, but seeing a Come baby on. try to keep up, well, that's just downright adorable. Meet Angelina, born July 9th, and Zori, born July 25th. Like all newborns, they're keeping their mothers and the elephant manager, Willie Tyson, very busy. Darling. Darling, please. <laughs> she got your training. That's funny. The staff is, is really new at babies. They've never been around babies. So they're learning, the herd's learning. So it's, it's kind of a unique situation that we're in right now. Any parent will tell you how hard it is to raise two babies at the same time. But when the babies weigh more than 300 pounds, it's a whole other ball game. The first thing we teach the babies, of course, is what you teach any toddler is no, what, what no means. Quit eating rocks, please. Quit eating rocks, little baby. The babies are starting to interact a little. You can see she's definitely much more of the, you know, I'm bigger, I'm badder, leave me alone, who do you think you are? And Angelina's like, yeah, 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 whatever. <laughs> Angelina is the more playful baby and loves roughhousing with Willie. She's still in play mode, so she learns, as I said, a lot of her coordination through play and, and just interaction, and it helps with the training further on. When, when she goes into training, like the other elephants, she, she's so accustomed to people touching her and being around her. Zuri, on the other hand, is a little more subdued. This is Zuri. She's, she's just started to where she can, mom will allow her to get away from her. Normally, the first week, Moji kept her very close to her. She's starting to learn how to use her trunk and starting to drink with the water. She's come a long way in her three short weeks of life. Here, just minutes after being born, Zuri is barely able to stand. Even though her mom Moja's labor only lasted 20 minutes, her pregnancy lasted a whopping 688 days. She set the recorded longest gestation period for an elephant. The longest previous to that was 674 days. So we were a little worried there at the end. We were sort of like, you know, is, is it okay? Is the baby gonna be okay? Zuri and Angelina are more than okay. They're thriving. Even their daily bath is a thrill. Turns out little elephants love playing in the bath water just like little kids. I know it's a lot of responsibility, mm -hmm. but it's got to be so much fun. Well, it is a lot of fun, but it is a lot of responsibility because we don't want either one of the calves to get hurt. And when you've got seven animals in the herd, you know, one animal can get stepped on, you know, one animal can get hurt accidentally. There is one other elephant at the Pittsburgh Zoo, the majestic bull Jackson, who fathered both babies. Male elephants are typically solitary, but the females all pitch in to help raise the babies. Even so, they get a little jealous when all the attention is on the newcomers. You jealous? Say, nobody's taking my picture. Hello. Hi. Nobody's taking my picture. Actually, zoo goers are taking plenty of pictures. The babies are a hit. It's easy to see why. You're funny. You are funny. They are so cute. You know, those babies have a lot of growing to do. They will grow two to three pounds a day for the next year to reach probably six to seven thousand pounds, Dave, oh. which is how big their moms are. And just three breeding males in the whole country. Yes, and there are only eight babies in the whole country, and for this zoo to have two is extraordinary. Three breeding males probably them. have a good time, too.